YouTube, YouTube, what's going on, man? So, I've got another little weekend trip that we're, we're taking right now. The kids don't know where we're going, but mom and dad know, so. We're actually rolling out of the neighborhood now, and we're gonna take you guys along so you can see what's going on in Phoenix. If you're not from Phoenix, then this will be good for you because it's gonna give you an understanding of what's in Phoenix and uh, how to get away from the heat. This time, I don't want to say we're getting away from the heat, but we're just getting out for the weekend. All right, so we got the little minis. Wifey over Hi. there. Hey, just hang on tight, man. I really do got to pee. The power of Thor, I will stay here. Getting the return. You can't really take a trip without coming back home, right? No, no. Are we off now? Round two. Are we good? Nope. Are we good? Alright. be able to get an entrance uh, coming into the to the place that we're going to for the surprise for these young ladies but we will get something tomorrow I did bring the drone and I have the camera so we'll see what's going on but right now they have a Foster's freeze so I'm gonna see what they got up in there hopefully they got the pineapple shake you want a pineapple shake oh, oh, unzip, unzip those things down there unzip them unzip them See if there's wind that blows through. Go unzip it. Get their pockets, basically. Oh, there's no vent? Mm -hmm. None at all? Those are all empty. So we can put stuff in. Oh, I 
like I have a fan. You can go sit out there on the chairs, yeah? Go sit out there on the chairs. Okay. Daddy, I'm sitting on the chairs. I'll go with you. That just feels amazing. Look at that. It's inside the skate ring. Yep. Got the bar stocked up. Ooh. Oh, it's locked up. I don't know. <laughs> this place is epic, man. We just arrived. It's 10 something at night, but they got it all lit up for us so you guys can see it at night. This is literally what it's going to look like with the lights and things going on as you skate around, man. This is beautiful. Massive crystal ball. That is awesome. What do you think of it? I think it's good. It's so cool. Do you think it's good? Not right now. only shy right now. Wait until it's bright outside. She won't be shy. <laughs> and you can do the
to this spot if you're if you're ever out here in Joshua Tree and you love reptiles, fish and fangs, man. It's like fish and reptiles. Super cool spot. <laughs> My daughter got to hold a snake. And I'm gonna make sure I put that picture in there. It's the first time I've seen her hold a snake. I don't know if she's ever done it at school, but super awesome. But um, good place to go to, man. Fish and fangs. Hey, Joe. All right, you guys. So I forgot to tell you that I actually came over here to this Crossroads Cafe. So that was one of the stops that we went to prior to uh, going to the Fins and Fangs. I gotta get the name right, Fins and Fangs. But let me tell you what happened. So while we were there, all right, we had our meal, super amazing meal. So if you get a chance, please go to that cafe if you come out here to Joshua Tree. And um, another cool spot is Des finds food and then I got this cool little cart too but uh yeah I left my credit card there man so please pay attention to your items don't leave your stuff there man and uh luckily they held it for me it fell out of the menu so I'm not sure how the heck it got in the menu but good place to eat definitely recommend it if you're in Joshua Tree also make sure if you visit that place Send a shout out to Autumn because she's super awesome there. She was one who found my card and held it for me. So big shout out to her, man. So Joshua Tree actually has a live market. So this live market is from 8 to 1 on Saturdays. Uh, I don't know if it's every Saturday, but it did say it on the radio. So now we're here. Just taking a quick look at things. Um, actually, it's really nice, man. They got some Greek items. They've got like salted peanuts. They got all kinds of stuff. Don't touch it. Don't breathe all over it, though. Yeah, why do you think it's so close? Okay, so close. Yeah, I should have gone home. Today, you can't take produce over.
So this is the driveway as you come in. This is what it looks like at night. This is beautiful. So you've seen what it looks like in the day, but at night, man, it's just so quiet. This is my tent. So we're actually in this tent here. It's a yurt four. If you're looking for um, a tent that can sleep four, that one actually sleeps four. We brought our own um, air mattress. And this is, now you can see somebody's driving in. And we brought our own air mattress for this one. There's another yurt and another one right over there. And then this is right where you drive in as you come in. This place is really epic, man. So if you're looking for a nice vacation, and these towers, matter of fact, so there's two towers. If you wanted to, you can, you can actually rent out the whole compound. But there is, you can't really see it now, so you gotta only see it in the daytime, but there's a silo, and then there's two um, other living quarters, but you've seen that during the day though. Thank you. 